Hey everyone, brothers and sisters, I've got something I want to share with each and every one of you. Amen. And I think it is going to not only just touch your heart, I think it's going to warm your heart as well. You all know my heart for the homeless. And uh, I want to share this with all of you because every time we turn on the television or get on our computer on the internet or even on the radio, there is always some negative, negative uh, reporting on our police. Uh, they are to protect and to serve. I'm going to share a wonderful story where these police officers, not only are they protecting, but they are serving the homeless food. They're serving them water and they're praying with the homeless. There's so much more that each and every one of us can do. There's just so much more. Let me share this then I just want to touch on one quick aspect. Uh, I, I got a question on the Mandela effect, but let me share this wonderful, wonderful video clip. And brothers and sisters, the time is late. We need to, we need to all open our hearts to the least of these, the brethren. Let me show you what these police officers have done for the homeless. <laughs> Wasn't that wonderful, just wasn't that wonderful, and there's so much that you and I, that we can all do to make a difference, to spread the love of Yeshua, the love of Jesus Christ. Let me have a sip of my coffee, hang on, hang on, I want to talk about the Mandela effect for, just for a second, hang on. This came up on a group I'm in on uh, my Facebook uh, page. Talking about how this ministry, with all of the viewers and subscribers that I have, the thousands and thousands of viewers and subscribers to this channel that tune in, very little comes in to help the homeless and to help those that are struggling in poverty. 
And that's where Yahweh got his call to me to this ministry here on YouTube and then to, to the streets of the inner cities. And I look at these prosperity preachers, these prosperity pastors of the prosperity gospel, the Laodicean church, the church that thinks they are rich and in need of nothing, but in, indeed they are poor and they are naked. They're going to come to find out. They're going to come to realize that. But I look at people like Joel Osteen, or is it Joel Olsteen? Is it with an L? Olsteen or Osteen? Something to think about. What is the correct way? I always said Joel Osteen. Now it's Joel Olsteen. I don't know, but if I had that kind of money, rather than live a lavish lifestyle and have bodyguards and a private jets or get, get on a plane and fly to Israel and uh, look at all the uh, relics there, the Catholic relics, and um, see the rabbis there and not preach Jesus to them, I would just try to go out. We could do so much more. We could make such an impact before that trumpet sounds. But sadly, what once was uh, called good is now evil, and what is evil is good. People are lovers of their self and lovers of money. And uh, the Church of Jesus Christ today, especially here on YouTube, they're being led. They're being led astray. They are following uh, uh, those that will tickle their itching ears. And this channel is all about the truth. And I'll in fact, Joel Osteen or Joel Olstein. Let me know. If you feel the Holy Spirit... Just lay it on your heart to help our ministry and outreach to the homeless. The links will be in the show more section below.